Hi, this is Brittany. Hey, Brittany, this is Matt with Brighter Image. Uh, we went back and looked at your GoFundMe page. Let me ask you a question. If we could get you a new smile in the next month or so, uh, and we could pay for it, would it be okay if we brought it to you in person? You wouldn't mind? Okay, great. Yes, absolutely. Okay, well, we'll set it up. Okay, we'll see you then. Thanks, Brittany. morning. Um, today we're going to Cincinnati, Ohio. Very excited about the smell makeover that we're doing today. Probably one of the youngest young ladies that I've uh, done one for. She's in high school. Just got bullied because of her smile. And uh, went to a dentist. Spent some years and some braces and it just didn't work out for her. She had too many bad things and she went online and asked us to help her and that's why we're going to Cincinnati, Ohio and I couldn't be more excited. So I hope today goes well. Then follow me and let's see how it goes. braces and I was really really excited because I had a huge gap that I was called sponge Brit for um, from first grade all the way up until seventh grade through those five years they would they pulled a tooth that wasn't supposed to be t uh, pulled out and put on wrong wires kind of ruined my braces experience so when they took off my braces even my retainer didn't fit at all so I was without a retainer that they wouldn't replace I was without dental records that they wouldn't hand over, and I was told by a professional, a dentist, that I had a 12-year-old smile, and my smile has always been my insecurity, so when a professional in the dental field said, yeah, you, uh, you have a 12-year-old smile, it really hurt me, and I just, I don't take pictures, and if I do, I always have someone edit my teeth in them, like, I'm open about that, like, the teeth that you see in my pictures now aren't my teeth. I want to be a doctor one day and I want to come off to people with a beautiful smile and you know show that I'm I, I take care of myself and I feel like a smile is the first impression someone gets and if I go into a job interview even as a high school and I smile I feel like that's already points deducted off my interview chart. I mean I'm just a general like happy person and I like to laugh and I like to smile and if if someone feels insecure about that, then they don't enjoy laughing and they don't enjoy the moment that they could laugh because they're thinking about their smile and that's always what I dealt with since I was eight years old. I made a GoFundMe page to get my veneers and now I'm here with Brighter Image Lab getting the smile that I've always wanted. I think having a smile that I'm going to be so proud of, the biggest thing is I will well, be able to go out and enjoy the moments with my family and be able to smile in situations where I can smile and I can laugh and not have to worry about covering my mouth and feeling insecure or having to wait multiple days to post a picture from an event for my friend to Photoshop it and nobody should have to go through that. So once I get the smile that I want, I'm gonna feel so much more confident to do anything. I remember Matt calling me and saying, and we over, 
several months have been watching your GoFundMe page and have been keeping track with your story. Let me ask you a question. If we could get you a new smile in the next month or so, uh, and we could pay for it, would it be okay if we brought it to you in person? And right when he said pay for your veneers, I started bawling. Like, I've never cried like a baby like this before. I remember running down the stairs, crying with the phone in my hand, like shaking, like, mom, I'm gonna get the teeth that I wanted. Like, yay! And like, my mom started crying, and like, we gave the biggest hugs, because I was at the point where I didn't even want to have my senior photos done. Like, one of the biggest moments in my life I did not want to have done because of my smile. So like, right when I knew that dates were set, I was like, okay, that's when I'm gonna get my senior photos done. Let's do it. <laughs> What attracted us to her was the action. That she didn't, you know, whether they get funded or not, you didn't sit around and go, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hope. You actually sat down and or went and put a plan together and go, I'm gonna do something that makes me different than someone who just wishes. And then we got the email and, you know, like, there was a lot of conversation like, you sure you don't want to just leave this alone? Or you're like, we, we think her spirit's pretty big. And that says a lot. So, <laughs> Whoa. They feel like they're in good? Yeah. They're in. They like this. Oh, wow. Look in here. Whoa! Oh. oh my god, I'm gonna cry! Don't cry, please don't cry! Mm -hmm. oh, that's you're gonna mess up your makeup! I know, you're gonna mess up your makeup! Oh, you gotta get a man a little bit more. Can you close your mouth on them? Yeah. Do so you feel like they're all the way on? And they're just not tall enough? Yeah, I feel like they're all the way on. They're just not like, tapping right there. Wow, look at the difference! Right? Like these look so pretty already. Just smile. Just smile. Just smile. Oh my god. Yeah. They look so natural. I'm so happy. Oh my god, they are gorgeous. Oh my god. I mean they this they look beautiful. Like just that one fix. That's all we have to do. Oh my god. I've always wanted canines. <laughs> oh my god. That'd be good. Uh huh. You could have told anybody there was anything missing, but then you see that smile, and it's absolutely perfect. It's, yeah. Big, big, big day. Um, we just got to the airport, got my tickets, um, trying to make it back. The flight's delayed, and so we don't know if we'll make it, but we're gonna try. This young lady named Brittany really did us a good job today. She's got a lot of hopes and a lot of a lot of things to achieve in her life, and, and I think she has a vision that she's gonna make it. And um, if she sees something that holds her back, she finds a way. So you can't be around her and not feel better. I'm so proud of what I think she's going to be able to do with her smile. And we always try to find people that we think not only will have a nicer smile, but it'll improve their life. But what I have to tell you is that we've done almost 20 blogs. 
and I guess I got a little too confident on this one. I didn't bring a spare. I didn't bring an adjustment. I, I just took confidence because the impression looks so good. This one was about 99%. And uh, I'm gonna make some adjustments to her work and I'm gonna send it out FedEx to her before the week's out. Brittany didn't miss a beat. You can see a little bit of gum tissue, of, of tooth between her gums. And she said, Bill, it's no problem, it's great. From, a, you know, from two feet away, you can't tell. And it was true, you couldn't. And I really had to second guess it, but it wasn't as perfect as I'd like for it to be. And so to us, it kind of kills our spirit because it's not the work that we want to do. We really want perfect. With the exception of that, we had a wonderful, wonderful day. And for the people who know her, you'll know that her smile is not a luxury. It's absolutely everything that she is. And it's a tool that she can't do without. And I had no idea that she was going to be this exceptional of a person. Um, and I saw that smile bring her out today. We had just a really good time. Uh, Bob, weave, and and left, right hook. Man, this girl's a fighter, and she's going to do well. Super impressive, good energy, super contagious. Um, and she's the reason why we want to do smile makeovers. She's the reason why we want to do veneers. And I hope that her, I hope that the work speaks for itself. Uh, the pictures I got already uh, are amazing. Like I say. We were 20, 30 minutes to the airport and my office called me and said, hey, you've got some pictures from the young lady that you worked with today. And so we got one of those and then I got another one, which I thought was pretty cool. And then there's her senior picture, which I thought was great. And then there's another one. She let's do what we did. And I think, um, I think we're better for it. So guys, wish me luck on getting home tonight and we're going to end it there. I just got the new veneers in and they feel and look and so much better. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. My teeth are already adjusting with each and every single word that I say. These, I'm getting used to them already and they look so beautiful. Thank you guys.